Well, now to a small local city making a big buzz. Woodland is named one of the best places to live anywhere in the country. CBS 13's Rachel Wolf is in Woodland with how the city is hoping to use their new title to bring in some new business. To get people some ideas. Liz Snyder proudly shows off her wares at Vintage House by Jay, her new shop on Main Street. We were really looking to slow down. She and her husband wanted to end their two hour commute from Roseville, so they moved closer to his job in Woodland. Everybody knows everybody, and that can be good and bad, but everybody's super supportive. Having grown up in a small town in the Bay, she loved buying a century old home and having a two block walk to work. She also loved the community vibe. I knew about Visit Woodland. They were a big promoter of the Honey Festival. Um, we just had the C10 car show here over Labor Day, which was fabulous. It probably brought 10,000 people to town, which is huge for business owners. That buzz is what's bringing more people there. In fact, livability.com just named Woodland number 55 in its top 100 best places to live in America and the second best in the state. Yeah, we're pleasantly surprised. The Chamber of Commerce says the ranking is based on things like housing, health care, education, infrastructure, and the economy. We're being found out. Uh, and of course, we're right next to UC Davis, which is a great partner for us in uh, many of the technology and research areas. But Woodland is a lot more affordable than Davis, and that's drawing in home buyers. As a chamber, we're extremely proud of it, and we want more businesses to know that we are a definite destination for them to look at when they look at relocating. The city will use the ranking to win more people over to a small town pace of life that Snyder says will lead to big possibilities. It's still a very homey small town, and I think it'll stay that way. Well, the site ranked more than 2,300 cities with populations between 20,000 and 100,000.